Council meetings are long and boring. Wouldn't it be great if they were short and unboring? This is why I invented the five-minute meeting. <laughs> okay, after the city council meeting of October 15th, you know, the administrative report started and the Ashland Canal vote is was going to be uh, November 5th, but now it's November uh, 19th because uh, this one can't make the meeting in there. He really wants to go, so there's that bit meeting. And then, and then, oh, oh, FYI, by, 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 this guy not here today. I, I don't know. He just forgot to tell you that he wasn't there. He's not there. Uh, 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 and, and then uh, the administrator continues uh, uh, and said, uh, and when it's under 20 degrees, there's a warming center at Pioneer Hall. There used to be. And so churches are in town are thinking of taking that on. And uh, if you uh, call OHRA Aura, if you would like to volunteer to do that. And then, oh, the uh, Conservation Commission report. Uh, the COCC maybe uh, started in uh, 2006 and developed the SEEP and CPAC and, and uh, the modification of the recover goals. Uh, uh, their duties were to uh, make recommendations about conservation things and conserving things. And, and they are uh, shooting lots of videos about climate mitigation. And they uh, love to do... Uh, they love, oh, uh, electric vehicles, actually, the EVA, and they, they have a reusable to-go container program. And then uh, the public forum, oh, uh, yeah, crazy crater guy, God, there he is. Uh, solar panels uh, production and batteries have some issues, uh, but they are better than not having them. And uh, more plugs in downtown parking lots, please. And then a lady with uh, glasses and hair uh, said climate change is real. And uh, we need to do uh, the solar farm and uh, e-car hookups. And then the consent agenda. Uh, the consent agenda. Uh, this one said, hey, uh, uh, I would like to pull one item out and uh, talk about it. It seems, seems like a thing. And uh, city minister said, oh, uh, that's just uh, council initiating work and it's not a big deal. And uh, land use amendments get started like this step. And then, uh, then some guy from the audience spoke up and said, uh, said hey, uh, uh, this is appropriate. There's, uh, there's uh, no need to uh, discuss this issue anymore. And so and then the issue was just never discussed. And so uh, all approved. And then uh, the new city hall. Oh, God. There you go. Uh, uh, oh, wait, who is? Oh, city hall manager said uh, yeah, she talked and talked and explained, explained that the uh, city hall at East Main, which is where it is now, is the best place. And uh, this one said, and said, hey, uh, yeah, I move we look at selling city land before agreeing to do all this city hall uh, options. And then uh, this one goes, he, he, this one went, I go, ah, nah, let's just uh, let's get the city hall thing uh, going and uh, uh, and uh, do the selling plans on the side while we're going at it. And then this one said, oh, hey, asset planning and changing course and something. And then uh, this one said, uh, uh, what it meant was I withdraw the motion and I just want to ask for a city assets assessment. And then this one said, oh, that's not on the agenda. And this one said, oh, oh I, can, I can change it again if I have to. And then the city lady said, oh, we, and we can do a clarification. And then he started moving a bunch of move, movements. And, and, uh, and then this guy said, hey, whoa, whoa, this is all out of order. All these things you guys, it turns out he was right. <laughs> they were all out of order. So then they just went to the public public forum. Okay, public forum. Oh, uh, there was a weird beard guy, uh, and he said, I love that you were looking into the assets thing. You're doing great, but watch the taxes. They are high. And then a gl glasses guy said, I voted in some committee, and uh, I support the city hall being re rehabbed at this location. And then the mustache and glasses guy said, it's essential that the city hall stay where it is. New city hall might be the only building left after an earthquake. And uh, we should help other buildings, uh, by the way. And then a bald mustache guy said, I'm not sure about this earthquake thing should happen, so we should pay off bonds. And then uh, this guy says, I move we move forward on rehabbing the city, old city hall right where it is. And then, uh, then this one says, I amend that we make it a uh, two-story building with energy efficiencies. And that amendment was approved pretty quick. And then this guy goes, he goes, hey, are, are we all on board with the old uh, the city hall at the old city hall? And then everyone went, uh, yeah, I mean, like, you know, yeah, we're like, it's not 100% this vote thing then, but it looks like it's 99%. So the old city hall has been fixed up where it is. Approved! And then uh, the damned safety contractor approval. So the uh, public works lady said, our uh, a city guy is an official, we have an official federal damn safety FERC approved guy. Guy with a big beard shows up and said, hey, I'm the FERC guy. 
And the big beer guy said, I went, oh, you're the best. And he said, yeah, so let me tell you about the dam, because I'm official. Uh, dam's in great shape. And the FERC says this, and FERC says that, and FERC, 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 he's, I mean, he FERC'd all over the place. But I, I lost track of what his point was, but he did say there is some uh, repair needed on one side, and that uh, we have a plan. And this guy says, let's do the damn work, baby. I mean, as in, not do the dam with an N, but he said, let's do some work on the dam. That's what he, and then they all approved it. That was all good. And then, oh, the repeal of some ordinance from 1999. There's some uh, development expected on, on the Waterline Road, and uh, there was an LID, and anyone there paid into a fund anytime they sold property, and it was a problem, and, and uh, nothing ever got developed. And so the Public Works uh, wanted to end the ordinance, and uh, so, yeah, uh, I'm not off a little bit there. I think they approved that. I think they approved that. And then there was uh, another issue that was uh, supposed to be coming up, and they all said, let's postpone this because uh, where'd he go? Oh, this guy wasn't there. He's a big proponent or ex, yeah, I don't know if he's pro or against, but involved in whatever that was. And so that was delayed. And then this one said, he said, uh, solar emergency staff direction uh, to add kilowatt hours for the uh, staff solar study. So things can be delayed, and, uh, and I, you know what? I think the meeting just petered out or I fell asleep, but uh, either way, end of meeting. You're welcome.